Good afternoon. It's uh, the tenth day in uh, the seventh month, which is July, as we all know. Thanks the tenth day, it's the seventh month, 2013. I'm pretty sure. Don't get me lying, but I think that's the correct date. Anyway, uh, back here again. I'm working on brother-in-law's uh, knife sheet. Make a little knife carrying case out of wood. Once I get this brass down to size and cut down to what I want shaped up, uh, I'm going to chisel them out of the clay to put in knife. 20th century survival knife. I've got a little trim off work here to do. This right here, I need to come off with about that much of that stuff there at least. Try to square that up. Before I do, I gotta see how much wood I got to play on here for this. Oh yeah, right there be good. See that? Then when I countersink that wood, it's only three sixteenths of an inch has to come out. And that this so it's loose enough that it can come in and out. And that pretty good sheet. Now I'm about to do some trim up work on this now. Let's see, I'm gonna go ahead and just for the sake of argument, mark off where the end of this point is. About so there. A little longer than where it is. So right there is where we've got to come off of that. Okay. I'm going to trim it up using the steel saw. And we're going to try this little trick here. We've got to go deeper if it'll like me. We'll see how deep I can go, I think. But that's probably as deep as it's going to let me go. And I'm taking that off there. Shoot. That's going to be what that means. Then I have to flip it over twice. Flip it over and do the bottom side. Where did that left there just tighten it down? First thing I want to do, I want to draw me a straight line take off that edge up there at the top and square it up. I'm going to square this up is what I'm going to do. Right here where this mark is, let's see, uh, find my speed square over here. Now I found one of them. I've got two of these. One missing, I'm not sure where it is. But anyway, right about here, I'm going to get that on there. Make a little mark and get that squared up there. as far as I'll need to go to keep that from splitting out by trimming the split part out. What I got in mind now, we know how far we're going. Now I want to uh, get a straight line down there to get rid of that bad edge here that I don't like in it. I want it there to cut down a little more. Dark, so I'll be able to see it good but as I'm cutting. Okay. We're going to see if we can cut that off. Sure, I can split that off, but I'm afraid I'll split it wrong. So, what I'm going to do, I'm going to try. That's not a good idea. I'm going to have to cut that left handed. On this side, I ain't going to be.
lined up in just a moment, folks. I'm not even sharing my camera. Yep, yeah, still on. Hang on a second. We didn't flip the button. Gotta find out which one it was. Because I'm not sure which one flipped it. Must be one of my one tens over here. This is the thing. This one maybe. No, that's the deep creek. This one flip. Oh, okay, maybe it wasn't none of them. Can't just swing on a second. I don't think the lost one there. Now it's not a button on it. Just flip that and want to cut it in fine there. Trying to run too much off on the magic. It's alright, we're about through anyway. So what I'm going to do here, I'm just going to cut down. I didn't cut myself. Sometimes I might. I have to really watch myself. Okay, now, knife out. Use mine. I'm going to finish trimming this off. But if you go too far, what I mean is we can. Where's my hammer at now that I need? I'm not seeing it. Be okay, we we'll use this. Yeah, no, I don't want to use that piece of wood be fine right here. There's something to drive that on down to there. What we're going to do is trim this up straight and get us a piece of woodwork in there. As far as I cut it, see, I didn't get cut any for it. But the saw wouldn't let me go no for it. That's ah, shoot. That's right, too. So, we've got to split it off there. I'm going to need a hammer to do that. Second here. Because I can't get my saw in there and go deep. Not a very easy one. There we go. Now we shave the piece out. Not correctly, but shave some off. That's what I was out to do there. Why did it cut it round as a saucer? Crap. I'll have a lot of square enough to do there. But I got the worst piece off there. So that'll be good, but that'll be alright. Now we'll take the rasp and we'll work that over. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to make a machine, that is, or a wooden sheet that's light but yet easy to carry. And it will keep you from getting gouged or stuck by the knife. Wood is uh, not real comfortable, but it's not a, not as bad as you might think. Put on the belt, carry it. At least that's my intentions here. So first, we we'll work this side down so we can even put the other side. It's a little bit prohibitive. Side. 